Good day and you're very, very welcome to our time in prayer. Time as we gather in the presence, in the power and the strength of the Lord Jesus. On this eve of St. Patrick's Day, Thursday the 16th of March, may you experience the blessings and Christ's presence with you as you journey in faith, hope and love. And as we gather today and as we pray today, we are focused on St. Patrick and maybe St. Patrick's breastplate. And you can just imagine the breastplate going out into war in some ways, that it protects you. It, 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 it keeps from the swords going through and, and that sort of image and likeness and ways. So, gathering as we do in prayer, we just invoke Christ's presence and Christ's love to be with you in a very deep and special way. I arise today through a mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity. Through belief in the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation, I arise today through the strength of Christ's birth and his baptism, through the strength of his crucifixion with his burial, through the strength of his resurrection and his ascension, through the strength of his descent for the judgment of doom, I arise today through the strength of the love of the cherubim, the obedience of angels in the service of archangels, in the hope of resurrection to meet with reward, in the prayers of patriarchs, in the predictions of prophets, in the preaching of apostles, in the faith of confessors, in the innocence of the holy virgins, in the deeds of righteous men. I arise today through the strength of heaven the light of the sun, the radiance of the moon, the splendor of fire, the speed of lightning, the swiftness of wind, the depth of sea, the stability of the earth, the firmness of rock. I arise today through God's strength to pilot me, God's might to uphold me, God's wisdom to guide me, God's eye to look before me, God's ear to hear me, God's word to speak for me, God's hand to guard me, God's shield to protect me, God's host to save me from snares of devils, from temptation of vices, from everyone who shall wish me ill afar and near. I summon today all these powers between me and those evils against every cruel and merciless power that may oppose my body and my soul against incantations of false prophets, against black laws of pagandom, against false laws of heretics, against craft of idolatry, against the spells of witches and smiths and wizards, against every knowledge that corrupts man's body and soul. Christ to shield me today against pies and against burning, against drowning, against wounding, so that there may come to me an abundance of reward. Christ with me, Christ before me, 
Christ behind me, Christ in me. Christ beneath me, Christ above me. Christ on my right, Christ on my left. Christ when I lie down, Christ when I sit down. Christ when I arise. Christ in the heart of every person who thinks of me. Christ in the mouth of everyone who speaks of me. Christ in every eye that sees me. Christ in every ear that hears me. I arise today through the mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity, through belief in the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation. St. Patrick's breastplate. May it be your breastplate too. With great confidence, we pray to God our Father as Jesus taught us how to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Mary, Mother of God, Mary of the Gale, pray for us now. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Three three persons in the one Godhead, we glorify you as we pray. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen.